Titan, Saturn's largest moon, has been the subject of a huge amount of study. It could be the most studied satellite in the entire solar system, next, of course, to our own moon. As a result, our knowledge of its surface is more and more detailed all the time. Along with jagged mountain ranges discovered last month, there's now solid evidence that lakes of methane exist near Titan's North Pole. Dr. Ellen Stofan analyzes the data coming back from the Cassini probe, which is orbiting there. I, I guess everybody would wonder if there's so much life in, in water lakes on Earth, is it conceivable that there would be life in methane lakes on Titan? One of the things that led us to go be so interested in Titan in the first place is the fact that Titan has what we think of or call prebiotic chemistry. It's got all of the building blocks for life. The planet is basically covered in all kinds of organic compounds, you know, things like methane, ethane, acetylene. And the other thing would be, how, what kind of space probe would we send there? Or could you land a space probe in, in a, on a lake in Titan? We'd certainly like to. One of the options you might send is some sort of a balloon type craft that could um, that maybe had some sort of boat-like uh, lander attached to it where you could touch down into one of these lakes, measure the chemistry of that lake, lift off, drift over to another lake, um, and drop down and study that lake. Oh, it's fascinating. Thanks, Dr. Stofan. Thank you.